anybody ever said anything nasty to you after? You know, uh, I choose to stay away from it. You know, it's, it's been a couple instances where, you know, people have not been the nicest, but uh, I, can't, I can't involve myself in that. So are you saying you just don't respond at all? Yeah, I mean, I just don't respond. Yeah. It's, it's, it's a situation where, you know, as a team, as a family, we stick together and get my strength from that. This doesn't have so much to do with you guys. I mean, I'm helping a, a writer in Nebraska with his story on this day because one of the Nebraska players had kind of a nasty interaction with the fan after the game. The, the fan saying things to him. But, I mean, th does that make you want to just turn it all off during the, the season? You know, so, you know, so, uh, sometimes uh, coaches will say in season that stuff goes away. You know, you got to be a professional about this situation. Everybody's not going to be your, your biggest fan. Uh, we're going to have critics. You're going to have people that that really don't care who you are as a person. But as a as a young athlete aspiring to be a professional, we got to know how to, how to handle situations like that. Is it fair though for for them to put that kind of thing on you for for fans to, to say things to you guys, you know, based on your performance on the field? You know. Uh, we're the people on the field, we're the people everybody sees. So uh, when we win, we get the credit. When we lose, uh, it's on us. It goes with the territory. Yeah. Okay. What, what is morale like right now? You no, know, uh, I would say it's, it's definitely more positive than it has been. Uh -huh. uh, for, for the first time, I can say we, we got something we can build on after a loss. Uh, yeah. We played two, two quarters of great football. Mm -hmm. and we just gotta, we got to start finishing the second half. If we we do that, we'll be fine in more games than not. I mean, we got five games, five games left in the Big Ten season, and uh, all of those are winnable games. Mm -hmm. uh, it's def definitely still for potential for a bowl game. Yeah, well, you guys had a good first half. I mean, could you feel it slipping, though? I mean, after that touchdown to go into the half, or did you guys still feel confident, or could you – did you sense that, it, that something might be going on? Because we've talked about it in the past – Kind of two different defenses. Could you yeah, feel I mean, it? Uh, definitely, I say after after that first drive in the, in the third quarter, you know, uh, we lost a lot of momentum uh, and kind of kind of went downhill from from that point on. But up until that point, we've been doing everything we needed to do. Uh, we watched it, we diagnosed it. Um, we're gonna try to find a way to fix it. Mm -hmm. Coach Cubitt said the whole offense watched film together. I mean, what did you guys do as a defense to watch film and talk about it? You know. Uh, we talk within our individual groups, you know, as players. We talk. We talked as a as a whole defense about what we need to do, uh, what we got to do to be successful these five games, and uh, we know what we got to do, man. Yeah. Thank you. Is there any any feeling at all after that loss against Michigan State that made you think about last year? Um, you know, I choose not to think about last year. But, uh, that's the past. But uh, probably one of the biggest things. I, I thought about after that game was don't let the morale get down. You know, uh, last year, we kind of got down. Uh, I said kind of early in the season, and they just they rolled into a big ball that we can't control. So, I mean, me as a leader, I've just been trying to keep guys up, uh, show them that it is some bright spots. Still a lot, a lot of a lot of football to be left but, uh, this season. We still can go to a bowl game. We just got to go out there and we got to play, play a good game. Man. Extra urgency for you, though. You know, uh, this is this is my last season. Uh, I'm, whatever happens this season, my name's gonna be on it. So I'm work, I'm gonna work hard. I'm gonna work real hard. Talk about keeping the guys up. Is it, is it tough to do that? Um, it's this is definitely an attack. You know, um, after after a 42 to three loss, you know, it's hard for some guys to see the bright the bright the bright spots in that. It's my job to point it out. You're going to one of the great uh, venues in college football. Are you looking forward to that? Oh, yeah. I'm definitely looking forward to getting my second win at Happy Valley.